Hi guys, it's me again. So we're going to cook um, beef pepper, uh, Asian beef pepper stir fry. So we have um, oyster sauce, hoisin sauce, sesame oil, pepper, uh, onion leeks, carrots, onions and garlic and ginger and uh, sirloin um, beef. So it's not going to be chewy. Okay, so we got some garlic here. Usually I use uh, one head of garlic. So as soon as it smells, you put your uh, beef. I'm sorry about this. It's like so crowded in here. your beef. This is sirloin so it's not going to be like bubble gum so I put some soy sauce, um, pepper, yeah, and then just it. I kind of spread it so it has an even cooking time. Sorry guys, I have to wash my hands. So here, we're sauteing the beef. So this sirloin, this type of beef, the sirloin will cook fast. So, you know, like I said, you have to cook it evenly. And then that's the time you add your other stuff in here. Okay. So, um, it juiced up this beef, so what I did is remove the juice from the, from the pan, put it here. We're going to put it back, so we can, we're not going to overcook the beef, and at the same time, we can saute it properly. So that's the trick. Usually, if your pan is, or your fire is not too hot, mostly in Asian cooking, you have to have high heat, low heat, you know, I mean high heat, high heat. But uh, since I'm just using an older stove, the tendency is to juice up. So I have to remove those juices so it will cook properly. And then before I add the onions and the garlic and the rest. Right, it's starting to sizzle. Alright, I'm sorry for the smoke. So it's starting to sizzle. So... Just brown it a little bit. With reducing a walk, you have to work fast, or else anything will burn. So add a little bit of oil, then throw your onions, and it has ginger too. I have to work really fast. Saute it a little bit. So I have to use this one to a bit, you know, just to mix it. And then you add your carrots. It should be just fast because, uh, like I said, the beef is really tender. Oops. 
Let's see, add your onion leaves. So you gotta um, let it this uh, boil for at least like two minutes, you know, just to incorporate everything. Uh, it's so pretty and so colorful. And then, like I said, this is the juice that we remove when we're stir frying, so let's just put it back. And then a little bit of water, half a cup of water. And then we'll cover it, this one for two minutes. Pardon me, I have gamers here. So, um, there you go. Just on high heat, two minutes, and then we come back to put the, the rest. Alright, so the carrots are a little bit tender. It's really good. So this is uh, hoisin sauce, oyster sauce, two tablespoons of oyster sauce one tablespoon of hoisin sauce okay. Okay. Ah, it's hard working with one hand pardon me so go there you go now if it's uh, a little um you know, uh, bland, just put this one, uh, a little bit of bouillon powder beef, just a little bit. Okay. And then, we put our peppers. Sorry about that. There. Just dunk it in there. Yeah, and that's it. This is, this is what you buy in... Asian restaurants just practically soy sauce and oyster sauce, you know. Now, just use a little bit of cornstarch solution just to uh, make it thick. Okay. And then, so we'll add a little bit of brown sugar. This is two tablespoons. Just mix it together. So this is your uh, beef and pepper stir fry. There you go. Like I said, it's really hard to cook in an electric stove. Usually this one is you're using a uh, gas, it'll be more nice. But it's looking beautiful right now, see? So you have to put a hole in here, just dig up a pit a little bit. So that's where we place our cornstarch solution. I'll be right back. All right, so we're almost done here. Like I said, we're just gonna add the cornstarch solution. Make sure everything tastes okay before you add this one. This is three teaspoons of cornstarch, half a cup of water. You're not gonna pour anything, uh, everything. You know, just see it's. Make sure it's boiling so it will work. See, it's already thick. See, now you have to work fast. Wow. See, look at that. There you go. Lastly, just add a little bit of your sesame oil. Just a little bit. Right, and then that's it. See? Shiny Asian beef pepper stir fry. Awesome. 10 minutes, 15 minutes. less than 10 minutes all right there you go
dishes. Of course, taste test with jasmine rice. Oh my god, I wish you guys can smell this. Oh, it's so hot. But look at that, look at that. Wait, wait, let me focus. See, the one that you buy in Asian store is chewy, so this is no chewy bubble gum <laughs> beef pepper stir fry. The peppers are still, it's cooked but it's still a little crunchy in the middle part, it's really good. Oh my gosh, I'm so hungry. Mm. Remember, sirloin, don't buy any other beef or else it'll be bubble gum chewy. See? Just look at that. Mm.